Women have played a vital and important role in our lives ever since the creation of mankind. Since the creation of mankind from my Hava, Hazrat Khatija Razila Talanho, to Miss Fatima Jinnah, to Benazir Bhutto, to Margaret Thatcher, from Lala Yusuf Zay, and now people like Shad Begum. Women have led governments, been commanders in the field, and have against, fought against tyranny and for justice, and have been a source of inspiration for many centuries. Many of the civil rights have been won because of the hard work that women have uh, done and who have stood up to all kinds of hurdles and blockages. As mothers, daughters, sisters, uh, wives, uh, they have shown us the path of love, affection, decency and dignity. As politicians, economics, uh, scientists, educationists, they have shown us the path of justice, care, fairness, compassion, but also firmness. The role they have played and are playing in our lives have given us hope, warmth, vision, and a sense of balance. Yet in many parts of the world, even in the so-called civilized nations, we still see the treatment of women as a second-class uh, citizen. In others, male used as commodities only to be abused and, and misused undermining their capacities, their dignities, and only to be humiliated and make them believe that they are only there to serve men as masters and have no individuality of their own. But they have the right to, and they should never doubt that they are valuable, powerful, capable of taking any challenge and deserving of every chance and opportunities in the world to pursue and achieve their own goals. We have to accept and must never feel threatened by the fact that women can reach to the highest position and are very capable of doing things, uh, making decisions and carrying out responsibilities equally as men. It is important for all of us to work together and raise our voices together and affirm, reaffirm that women's rights are human rights, regardless of their background, culture, nationality, uh, race or gender. We say that women education is a nation education. Then we must make sure that we give them the opportunity and space to educate themselves and to improve the quality of their lives. Uh, to make decisions at the highest level, to be valued and recognized as an asset and not as a threat. On this, year, uh, this day, we must make sure that we never allow this day to be only one day, but every day is a woman's day. Thank you.